Have you ever wondered what to do when the potatoes you bought start to form eyes like this? Well, all those eyes are new potatoes forming, asking you to please plant me. So today I'm gonna show you how to turn old eyeing potatoes into a new bountiful potato harvest using five gallon grow bags. These potatoes are fingerling potatoes, one of my favorite roasting potatoes. I went a little crazy at the farmer's market and had some left over and in the heat they started to form eyes fairly rapidly. So instead of throwing them out, I'm gonna think about the fall and plant these guys now and try and grow as many new potatoes as I can. First, let's get our soil mixture together, which is just a blend of organic potting soil and some organic compost. I'm growing in these root patch grow bags that are made from recycled plastic bottles and are great because they're light and easy to move around. So potatoes don't get planted like other things, a mistake I made that I'll show you later in this video. The potatoes form on the lower end of the stem. So you're gonna have to plant these potatoes fairly deep and the way we do that is by filling the bag up about a quarter of the way with soil, adding the potatoes, and then filling the remaining three quarters of the bag up with soil to top it off. Foliage will start to breach the soil and beneath the soil is where all the potatoes are gonna to start to form and develop. So first we're going to add a mix of the potting soil and the compost. Compost is a little bit more expensive so I mostly use potting soil and amend it with as much compost as I see fit. Then I'm adding my all-purpose 5105 fertilizer to the soil and mixing that in. I also have this mycorrhiza powder, which is this beneficial fungus that works in unison with the plants, helping bring water and nutrients to the plants. Mix that into the soil and a small amount where the potatoes are gonna sit, and then add two to three of the eyeing potatoes equally spaced out on top of that soil, and then fill the rest of the bag up with that same formula. Once you're done filling up the bag with soil, give it a good soak. A lot of that potting soil is dry, so kind of flood it quickly, let it absorb in, flood it again, make sure it's well saturated with water from the start. All that organic matter and compost is gonna act like a sponge because we got really good soil, so once we get it real moist, we don't really have to worry about it drying out too much. And then we're just gonna let these guys go. And in a few months, you're gonna have potatoes growing. And then this is what you can expect to see after a few weeks. This is the mistake I made that I told you about earlier. I kind of planted them too shallow, but this is the foliage that is gonna to start to grow out of the soil. So keep an eye out for that. I'll definitely do a check-in when these are ready to harvest so you can see how well they came out. Otherwise, that's all that I have today. I'll see you next time. Until then, take care of yourself and go feed yourself.